Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my graphic design channel. And today we are going to create design which is uh, will be good for free holidays. It's uh, Valentine's Day, it's Women's Day and it's Mother's Day. And this is that design what we are going to create in Adobe Illustrator. And before we start to create that design, I want to invite you to my Instagram. Now you see me in Montenegro, in a small town, Herzog Novi. And if you want to see my life as a simple girl, not only a graphic designer, you can come to my Instagram. And as well, I want to invite you to my Telegram channel, where you will find a graphic design chat and all information about my graphic design course and my YouTube tutorials. And now let's start to draw that design. That illustration I want to use for the cosmetics brand, which is called Happiness, and the slogan will be looks gorgeous on you. And uh, in the real life it will be look like this. And now let's start to draw our design in Adobe Illustrator. This is size of my workspace and these are colors which I'm going to use in my tutorial. And if you want to download an original vector file with my colors and uh, design, you can go to my Patreon page. The link will be below this tutorial. And now let's start to draw. My workspace is ready and colors are already in the swatches panel. And uh, let's take skin color and pen tool. And let's start to draw the face with pen tool. Okay, like this. Close the puff. Now uh, let's draw the nose. as well with pen tool like that now direct selection tool select that point and round the corner now let's uh, take that color and draw the lips with pen tool at first um, you are drawing elements and after you always can fix the size the view uh, with uh, changing the scale with uh, help of direct selection tool and with help of other tools what you need to make your design better but at first always uh, draw um, the main elements of course if you have uh, the sketch if you draw something with help of um, uh, your drawing skills on paper uh, and after and uh, you you um, using your sketch it's uh, sometimes easier but if you draw like me without sketch and photo at first the main elements and after just fix them okay like this um, now let's draw the hair Let's take brown color and curvature tool. You can draw any hairstyle as you like. I'm going to draw that one. 
if you need to fix uh, points you can always move the points with curvature tool okay like that now let's fix a little the lips let's move them here okay and i want to add here one point with add point tool and move that point with direct selection tool okay um one more time here i guess i like it better now let's take that color and draw here the ellipse move that point a little to the right and this one a little to the left okay now brown color and brush tool and let's draw the eye like this and select and uh, rotate and let's draw here eye lashes okay you can always fix the element with direct selection tool for example or rotate it now let's draw with pen tool and brown color the eyebrow the eyebrow one more element of eyebrow here let's make it a little bigger like that let's take pen tool and draw here one more element Okay, now let's fix some elements till you like the result. I will fix it mostly with um, pen tool and changing the scale. okay now let's take that color and uh, brush tool and draw here elements on the hair select all elements and we need to take here basic brush and the size will be two okay and add uh, some elements uh, let's take that brush and the same color and add some strokes
like that. And now guys, let's make a little stop and I want to invite you to my graphic design course Commercial Portfolio Step Up. All information about my course you will find on my course website and my course has two levels. Level one is when you will be studying by yourself. If you're sure that you can uh, make all tutorials on my course by yourself and if you understand that you don't need my support, you can go to level one. But if you want to study with me and if you want to have my advices and my opinion about your designs and about your portfolio, you can go to level two and study with me for three months. The next um, course with my support will start on March 1st and you need to hurry. And uh, if you want to study with me, you can go to course website and uh, take your place now. I will take only 30 students to study with me for three months. But if you want to study by yourself, for example, you can go today to my course website and buy my course and study already today. But if you want to study with my support, you need to buy my course from February 15th to February 29th and on March 1st we will start our course with me. All of you will have my personal support on my course. Uh, so if you want to start with me you can go and buy your place and if you want to study by yourself you can go to level 1 and buy my course and study by yourself. You will have 200 days to make my course. And now let's move on. Now let's take skin color and uh, rectangle tool. Let's draw the rectangle like that. It will be the hand. Direct section tool, move that point down and the same this one up. Curvature tool. Let's move at the point and move it a little up and here at the point and move, move it a little down. Now pen tool. Let's draw here some element like this. Select both elements, Pathfinder uh, minus front. Okay, and uh, move that point a little down. Now let's draw the arm here with pen tool. like that, make it a little bigger, just fix the points, select these two elements, Pathfinder Unite, select that point and round the corner, ok, it's ready. Let's move that point a little like that. Now let's uh, make the hand a little bigger. Make the copy. Hold ALT and make the copy and send to back. Put like that. Okay. Let's um, move on, let's take uh, orange color and curvature tool and create uh, the dress here.
Now hold odds to close the puff. Okay. Send the dress to back like that. You can um, always fix elements or with uh, dark section tool or with curvature tool. Okay, here I am using dark section tool. Take brown color and curvature tool and let's add some more hair. Change filter stroke. Move that hand to back. Okay, like that. Now let's add one more hair element. Like this. Okay, now a stroke. Use that shape and uh, the size, let it be two. And the same here. Two. Okay. Now let's better free. Okay, and now let's uh, take curvature tool and move that points. Okay, select the girl and let's group it. Okay, now let's uh, add background. Let's take that color and rectangle tool, create the square, send to back, let's select uh, sorry, other color for the background. Um, that one. Okay. Let's take white color and brush tool and let's start to draw at first the first element of the flower. We need that option in the uh, brush tool and let's start to draw. Take brush tool, draw the first element, change stroke to fill, and let's draw other elements. Okay, it's ready. Now let's take brown color and pen tool and let's draw the next element. The first leaf with pen tool 
I'm going to draw here. And now let's draw other leaves. Let's add colors. Okay. Select all elements of the branch and group them. Let's make a little bigger. Change here the size of the stroke on two. Okay. Let's make that element a little bigger. Take mm, pen tool. And let's draw here one more element. Like that. And all elements with pen tool. It will be easier if you if you lock the layer with the girl and background. Okay. Okay. And so the size two of the stroke. Now let's take a yellow color and ellipse tool. Make the one ellipse and now make the copy. Rotate. Make one more copy. Rotate. Down. A little wider. Let's fix some elements with direct section tool, like that. Let's move the elements like this. Select all elements, Pathfinder Unite, and Smooth Tools, move here a little the side okay it's ready now let's add some uh, brown ellipses here it's elements of the flower group okay and move some flowers here just copy and paste them and change the view of the ellipse with ellipses brown ellipses with dark suction tool now you can move 
uh, the flowers in the places you like the most okay let's move on now let's take that color and ellipse tool and one more time create flutter with ellipses and pen tool Okay, the floor is ready and it's on its place. Now uh, take brush tool and light orange color to create uh, the flower shape like that. Change stroke to fill. Okay, now we are going to take that color and brush tool and create one more element inside change stroke to fill ok and add some brown elements inside with ellipse tool And now I'm going to create uh, the flower shapes with brush tool of different colors. The first uh, is the shape and after I'm going to add inside elements. Change the scale of the elements to make composition more interesting. Okay, add the elements, but they already draw to make composition more interesting. Change colors, add flowers. Okay. Now here let's delete some leaves and add elements. Now add flowers here. Add elements inside flowers with brush tool. Okay. Add one more flower here, something like this and element inside okay again change uh, the stroke add flowers it's your flower composition you can make it bigger smaller so as you like uh, add flowers here change some colors Take brown color, let's write with text to happiness. Okay. And next one looks gorgeous on you. Okay, now change the size here on 30, maybe 25, let's uh, take the font Montserrat, you will find the fonts below this tutorial, uh, let's take uh, Montserrat uh, regular, 
the size will be 15 okay and now uh, let's change happiness okay let's move it here and maybe let's take brown color for this uh, text and uh, maybe let's change the font here on other font I think um, this one will be better okay create outlines make it a little bigger create outlines bigger move down okay it's ready now let's um, rotate a little element here like this now let's um, copy and paste background select background but at first unlock it and unlock the girl copy and paste background and bring to front uh, ctrl a and object clipping mask make okay it's ready guys you will find mock-up link below this tutorial if you don't know what is mock-up you will find my video about mock-ups and how to use them and see you in the next tutorials in adobe illustrator or in the next videos about a graphic design